is Brandy. And I'm Gracie, and today is Thursday, December 7th. A couple nights ago, the school held the Fall Sports Award Night, and for most improved was Alex Clark, and the most valuable scout player was Titus Walner. The Blue Collar Award was awarded to Great Hamilton, and the Big Ugly Award was awarded to Peyton Nelson. Ty Hofer got both the offensive and defensive MVP, and the Patriot Award was given to Caleb Warner. The Patriot Football All-Performance team was Caleb Warner, Zach Banger, Peyton Nelson, Ty Hofer, and Grant Hamilton. The honorable mention All-State was Ty Hofer and Peyton Nelson. And for the Junior High Awards, the most improved was Brian Close, and the most valuable was Kyle Hamilton. Congratulations. For volleyball, the off-conference teams in first place was Allie Banger and Bailey Enander. Second team was Ashley Otto. Third team was Bailey Cole. And then for the honorable mention was Cameron Binger. Academic All-State is Ellie Binger, Bailey Enander, Bailey Cole, Ash Tomato, and Cameron Binger. The Academic Team Excellence Award, um, the South Dakota All-State Honorable Mention was Bailey Enander. Best Offensive Player was Bailey Enander. Best Offensive Player was Ashlyn Otto. Hustle Award was awarded to Cameron Binger. Patriot Pride Award was awarded to Bailey Cole. Serving Award was given to Allie Binger, and the most improved was Cindy Maynard. Good job. Okay, um, for cross country, the most improved girl was Danielle Noel. Most improved boy was Zach Gilbert. Most valuable girl was Allie Binger. Most valuable boy was Logan Gilbert. And the Determination Award was given to Titus Wilmer. For academic All-State, it was Tyler Schoen and Ali Bear. Good job. Last week, I talked to some elementary schoolers about their upcoming concert, so here's that. Hi, I'm Brandon Weeby, and I'm here with Devin Enander. So what are you doing in the play? What songs are you singing? I know about Snow and Mr. Frasky Went There. Okay. So what's, are you doing anything fun in class? Um. So what's your favorite thing to learn about? Math. Yeah? Math? So do you know, like, multiplication and division yet? Not division. I only know multiplication. Okay. Can you give me some problems? Like, what's 3 times 7? Twenty one. There you go. Okay, so um, so you went on Thanksgiving break. So what did you do for Thanksgiving? Um, ate turkeys. Yeah, was that good? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, well, thank you. Um, some announcements for this week are Ashton Otto and Bailey Enander are holding a book drive for their SCCLA project, and the donated books will be given to the high school and elementary school libraries. So they would like it if you would donate your gently used books. Yep. And then on Sunday, December 10th at the high school, from 2 to 4, Santa will come and visit and you can play bingo with him. There will be prizes and goodie bags for all the kids. There will be a holiday food drive on December 11th through the 20th. The 6th grade class, along with the rest of the elementary school, has challenged the high school kids to a food drive challenge. All donations will be collected at either school in the cafeteria. Please bring non-perishable items only. Non-perishables only. <laughs> so this season, who are you going to be looking forward to for leadership? Um, right now, we have a few captains. Um, let's start with Zach. Um, he is a very talented young man. Also, then we have Grant, Caleb, and Ty Hofer. Um, with those young men on and off the floor, we're looking for some really sp spectacular leadership. Mm -hmm. And you have a game with Groton coming up here soon? Um, so what can you tell me about them? Um, well, I'm new to the conference, being my first year as a coach here. Um, so right now we're just about to start our scouting process. Um, the little bit I know about them, they're very athletic, um, they're very intense, um, shoot the ball very well, and we're going to have to play some really actually team defense and stay together throughout the whole game. Yeah, so it is your first year coaching, so what are you going to be uh, working really hard on this year? Um, team leadership. Um, executing, and actually a lot of effort on and off the floor. All right. Well, good luck the rest of the season. Thank you very Thank much. Thank you. 
Hi, my name is Brandon Weeby, and I'm here with Coach Smith. So what are your expectations for the season? Well, we look to have a positive season, and we obviously want to end with a winning record and be able to play deep into the postseason. Um, so who are you looking for on the team for leadership this year? So who are you looking forward to leadership this year? Well, we have three seniors on the team this year, Bailey, Allie, and Tyler, and they have provided excellent leadership so far, and we're really going to be looking um, to them throughout the season for some leadership. All right, and you have an upcoming game here soon. What can you tell me about the opponent? Well, we play Westington Springs. It's a very familiar opponent for the girls, obviously not familiar for me as this is my first year, um, but I know that they're you know, a member of the 21 Conference, and it should be a good matchup for us. And then finally, uh, what are you looking forward to improving over the season? You know, just as a team as a whole, that we continue to get better throughout the season. Mm -hmm. And um, just so you know, we keep getting better and better, and so we're ready come playoff time. All right, thank you. All right, thanks. Signing off, I'm Brandy. And I'm Grace, bro. Stay classy. It's Hitchcock to air.